I am out here today exploring along the river and I just came across this old textile mill. It's been abandoned a long time. We're definitely going to have to explore around. Look at the river. Nice and low. Man. It's a great place to come back in the summer. Do some water hunting. I don't have my detector with me today. I actually only brung my magnet. I planned on going magnet fishing in this river. So maybe we'll find something. This is a 260 pound magnet. No telling what it will pick up. Let's head on down this hill and explore the other side of this textile mill. <laughs> it's abandoned out here in the middle of nowhere. This way. Wow. It's awesome, ain't it? I bet this place dates back to the late 1800s. Could be older, but that was the time when everybody was in the textile mills working. Let's go down here to the river. Now this would be the perfect place to throw in my magnet. Right over here in this deep spot. Man, I can't wait to get out here and see what I can find. Somebody's been out here. Look at the footprints. It's crazy, ain't it? We're not the only ones here. <laughs> wow. There's like a big rock cliff over here. This is an amazing spot. Here's a better view of the old meal. I bet if we had my AT Pro with me, might be able to pull out some old silver. That'd be cool. Because you know the workers that worked in this meal, they'd come out here and swim in the river and Blue stuff. I'm not sure how I missed this earlier. But we have us a phone. Probably has a bad connection. And they don't make them like this anymore. <laughs> Look at that. Let's go catch us some iron. pushing it downstream, I can feel the vibration in the rope. Nothing but black sand and magnetic rocks. Let's keep trying. You know there's something out here. I am hooked on something. I just threw it out there. I don't know if it's around a rock or if it's hooked on a big piece of metal, but man, it is. 
It's on there good. Whatever. Pretty big. Oh, I don't know if we're going to get that off. It won't move. What do you say? You think we ought to keep pulling this rope? It's a bummer, ain't it? We got out here, we haven't been here 15 minutes. Like my third throw in, I got the magnet hooked on something. It's either hooked around a big rock that's stuck in a bedrock crevice, or it's hooked on a big piece of metal, and it's iron. So, I guess you could say, what's on the magnet? Because I don't know. It might be a big safe, could be a car, or just a big piece of junk from the mill. We may find out one day. I'll have to go get my chest waders and come back and get out in that river, maybe. But not right now. We'll wait till it warms up. We may try going on the other side and get a different angle and pull from over there to see if the magnet can come loose. But I guess we'll keep on exploring around and see what we can find. Careful, you have to watch out. Sometimes there's big holes in the ground that you may fall in. Or poison ivy. This time of year you get it bad too. You can't see the leaves on it. At least I do. I'm highly allergic to that stuff. Check this out. It's a little hole inside of the building. I guess it goes into the basement. You see anything? Looks like somebody wrote a date on there. 4 24 2016. That was recently somebody's been in here. Anybody in here? Looks like Mandy and Ronnie's been in here their name right there on the stud I brought my headlight I just don't got it with me it's in my backpack I'll take it out let's get out of here explore something else wow goes upstairs apparently. Look at all the paint coming off the walls. Probably old lead paint. It's not good. Wow. What a place. This old mill looks like it got caught on fire burned down. That's why it's no longer in use. Hmm. Could have been a cotton mill. It's probably what it was. Something to do with that. back under this old mill now in the basement and this is really cool there's a big hole down here you wouldn't know it unless you shined a light down in it whoa 10 feet down in there but what really gets my attention is not the hole but it's these boxes up in the corner. You see that? There's a box. There's two of them. That one looks kind of empty. But the other one, it looks more like a box. The one in the back. I just don't know if that's something 
they hid, like if it was valuables and they knew people couldn't get back here to it, or if it's just junk. Be awful difficult getting to it. I'd have to jump down in that hole and walk around. I don't know. No telling what's in there. I think I want to go down in there. Nothing like exploring on December 24th. Let's go down in here. It's a big drop off. Good six feet there. But I'm going to slide down. So let me put this over my nose. I don't want to inhale any dirt or chemicals. I don't know if I'm in shape for this. Already. All right. See where I'm at. I'm standing on this brick pillar. What a hole. All right. Now cameraman's coming down. I don't know what these boxes are. Pretty soon. Okay, that there is a box for the air. No, it's not the air vent. I don't know what it is. It's an old box. Oh. Yeah, that's just that's it's just a box. You can see the handles are right here. I think it's upside down. Huh? This is same thing. It's some type of old brass. Maybe that's not brass. It's plastic. It looked like brass because it was green. But see, it's a old bin for something. It's all riveted together. I wonder what that was for. They probably stored something. Maybe like materials. I don't know. Whatever they made here probably stored products in this box we're going to put it back how it was well here's a big old chisel I reckon that's cool just the same we've been here I've left my mark. Now, everyone will know. I've been under a textile mill. Boo! Let's get out of here. What a great day. It's been a great day. Let me slide down this cliff for fun. This is where I wanted to throw my magnet in, but we didn't make it this far. We got hung up on a car or some big piece of metal. Well, that's all right. We'll eventually get that magnet unhooked and we'll be back in action. Just not today. Thank the Lord, though. It's been an awesome time to 
just get out and explore some places right before Christmas. There's a couple bottles down there. That green one looks kind of old. Got to find a way to get down there and get it. Let's walk around. What a drop. Let's get this bottle. That don't look that old. We can get down here though. Nope. Pretty modern. Guess that's German. Since we picked it up, we'll go ahead and get it out the river. <sighs> Gotta get out of this. Figure it out the best way. I guess just jump. You're on the side now. That's what it feels like. Wish I had my rope. Let's go up this way. Here, pretty good ways. Keeps going too. All right, let's see if I can make it up this ledge here. Oh. This gets you in shape if you're not already. Oh. Unbelievable. It's like a cave in the side of this cliff. Oh wow, it goes up in there. Let's see how far, I think it just stops right here, but man, maybe it was a mine shaft or something. They dug it out at one time and covered it up. Ah. It goes a little ways in there, then it stops. This is cool though. I didn't expect to find this. Yeah, it ends. place to swing your coil. Wow, find all kinds of stuff today. It's pretty cool, wasn't it? It's going to keep me up all night, not knowing what's on the end of the magnet.
Good view, ain't it? Time to head on back to the truck. It's getting dark out here. It has been an amazing day exploring. Found all kinds of interesting things. Old mills. A box with nothing in it. Got my magnet stuck on who knows what. And even found a cool little cave in the rock. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Y'all have a Merry Christmas and God bless.